Antonio Jose Bolivar, S.E.O. Cupabada, Mantener Lose Rea, and Tonto Los Colonos, Destrozaban La Selva, Construyendo La Obra, Maestra del Hombre, Civilizando El Desierto. She looked at his face, so old and wrinkled, so beautiful and just right. Old man with a young mind, tis much younger than the young man with an old mind. After the wink, his head moved. Down and his eyes made a beeline to my chest. Ooh, the old man felt me up with his eyes. Men really are all just alike no matter the age. He was a flirtatious old fossil. He looked ninety years old for thirty years, and then he got the notion that he would die, and did so. Thump Milton loom over, re a fabled man, his face a monument of Ozark stone, with juts and angles and cold shaded parts the sun never touched. Dot, 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 allow me to be an old man for a moment and to remind that young girl who is used to being impulsive that there can be none of that any more. Old men sign war and assign young men to bear arms and die. Is that how the youths become leaders of tomorrow? The aged are really eating the young. It may well be that what gives to the wind along that Wessex coast its indescribable mixture of vague sorrow and wild obscure joy comes from its passing on its unpredictable path, the floating hair of so many lovelorn maidens and the wild tossed beards of so many desolate old men. The idea that old men become peaceful or philosophical, what shit one learns to endure, that is all. He worried that when he would speak of the past, he would sound and look old as all ancient storytelling men did. They say that youths are leaders of tomorrow, and tomorrow's ever coming. But never arriving, old men are leaders of today and today's ever. Present will the youths ever lead when? There is no difference between a madman and a professor. Dot, 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 it should be clear to you in the way they dress, act, and think. I could hear an old man in the Stole next to ours sucking a hostler's cock I thought of, animals gathering at assault, lick during the night near a cave, carnivore rubbing shoulders with deer. Next door I could hear the old man's soul flap its heavy vermilion butterfly wings as the hostler shot a load down his throat. Repression, her therapist, Dr. Solomon, dot loved the word. He'd say it slowly, letting it roll off his tongue. Sometimes he'd at a chin stroke for good measure. He always looked pleased when he did this, like he discovered the caramel secret or something. Testosterone autism, the person beset. By this ailment, dot, 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 develops an interest in various tools and machinery, and he's drawn to the Second World War and the biographies of famous people, mainly politicians and villains.